Hey guys, welcome back to the channel, Thriving Thrifters, Clarissa here. And I have my director, John, Ronald Reagan, mm -hmm. back from the, the abyss, the abyss, heavens, the abyss. If you're new here, welcome. We're a crazy dysfunctional family and I like to do mystery unboxings. And torture her family. Cozy. Thread up. It's not torture. I'm not making you do the five pound. That five pound. Because I wouldn't. Five pound jewelry has been sitting over there since January. Taylor said she'd help you with it. No, she didn't. <laughs> I ain't doing it. That's um, why you bought that little stand right there. Yeah, it doesn't work. Why Taylor, doesn't it work? It won't hold my phone in there, little thing. Oh, that little thing won't hold your phone? And I got this little thing at the bins so that I could record myself <clears throat> doing the five pound DIY because I know that nor, neither John nor Taylor will do it. And my phone won't slide down in there. But Taylor was doing all kinds of stuff. Oh yeah, it'll bend all kinds of different directions. Anyways, that's not what you're That's what she for. said. I am a part-time reseller on Poshmark, eBay, Facebook Marketplace, Mercari, Depop. Didn't get to record a ship with me this week, but I did have sales on all of those platforms, whoop, whoop. except Facebook Marketplace. I did not have any sales in there this past week. So, today I'm coming at you with a Thread Up 15-piece mixed jewelry. And I only bought, you weren't here for this video, I only bought three Thread Up boxes in the month of March. And none, well, we're only in the first week of April, but I haven't bought any for the April. And I don't know if I'm going to, because I think that I'm going to do a Ben's project, I think. We'll see. I don't know. We have Easter, so I don't know. Anyways, this is from Pennsylvania, and it is 15 pieces of hopefully <laughs> branded sellable jewelry. It's supposed to be a little more curated than the DIY. And I can get John to do this because it doesn't take three hours, but he still hates doing jewelry. I don't mind doing jewelry as long as it's good stuff. We like to do a little something where we put it into the universe, it being something we want out of this box. John apparently wants to go first. K.S. Okay. Um, Pandora. Pandora. So I'm gonna go with holding out. I knew it before you said it. I don't remember what the Pennsylvania jewelry. Georgia is in little individual bubble bags. Arizona is usually okay, in it, one big. Um, There's a sharp knife right there. Baggy. Let's see when I ordered this. February 25th. February 22nd. Oh, that's close, too. That was just a random guess. $48, 15 pieces, mixed jewelry. Put that in my stack. Two stickers. One, two. I love that hair in my Three. You've got bubbles. Bubbles and baggies. Lots of bracelets. Bubbles and baggies and bracelets. Mm -hmm. Oh, wait. <laughs> Get Taylor's sandwich in here for lunch. Mm -hmm. She likes the end of the tub You know that. This is a little clamper. I don't see any markings. A little silver clamp bracelet. There goes John with this. I don't think it's anything. <laughs> oh, yes. Costume jewelry. It's unique though because it's kind of a square.
blue and white enamel silver tone bracelet. This, this, <laughs> that matched checkered. dominoes. I was going to say some like checkerboard or something. <laughs> it matched a bunch of dominoes. That's cute. Not even a bracelet. Wow. It saw dominoes. Google Images sucks. <laughs> Although when it looks at you, it sees beauty. Oh, boy. You're dumb. He's a liar. I'm not lying. I'll see beauty. That's cute. I'm going to find something that matches, damn it. I think it's going to be this. This is a brushed gold. No, I saw slipped. your cleavage. Took pictures of your shirt. <laughs> it matched your shirt. I feel violated by your <laughs> camera. By Google Images. Most Google Images, it wasn't me. This reminds me of... um. Like a Wonder Woman bracelet. Yeah. Ooh, too bad it isn't that. I was going to say that superhero woman. 18 karat gold wave band. 2,180. Maybe, Maybe it is. That's what that looks like. Yep. So here you go. $2,180 right here. Does it have any marks in it? No. To prove that? No. It's probably got dollar store marks in it. That doesn't feel super cheap. So it should be 50 cents at the dollar store. I actually thought this might be Kendra. Reminds me of her. Oh, you know her so well. It's taking a picture on, of your bracelets. shirt. Trying to, oh my. <laughs> Go on. And they're all costume jewelry bullshit bracelets. Oh, this stretchy one's one. cool. Keeps on focusing on your shirt. There we go. Still in dot. Right. Um. Yeah. Twelve dollars. Did it come up with still in dot? I don't know if it came up with still oh. in dot, but square fall rhinestone tassel stick. Oh, that's earrings. Damn it. Retro rhinestone stuffy bracelet. Oh, that was listed for a dollar. Yeah, <laughs> costs more than that to list. <laughs> Bikini competition bracelet, is that what it is? Yeah. Shoot. Uh, oh, that one. I want it to be that one. Four row diamond bracelet, $75,000. Does it have four rows? It has a mark, but I don't know what it is. Gosh almighty. Hmm. I don't know. Maybe that'll be a game that we can play then, is what the most expensive match that we can get is. That one was $75,000 at whims of the day. <laughs> Stretchy and it seems very small. If you can sell that for $75,000, you can quit your day job. Yeah, I'm sure somebody who has $75,000 is searching for stuff on eBay. They might be. <laughs> it might be it's our support on Poshmark. There you go. Oh, that's my girl right there. Oh, God, that didn't match anything but horror. Dumpster fire? Yeah, the, hang on. I was just getting focused on it. It's going to bring up Kate Spade bracelet. Okay, but I want to get a match and see how much it's worth. It's worth nothing if I have to sit here and hold, hold mm. it. Kate Spade, New York, and it's white enamel with this gold spade. There it is on Poshmark. 28 bucks. Okay. Nice. I won the day. I got KS. There's five bracelets, y'all. Is that number six? Oh, it's a necklace or a belt. I don't know which one. Is there a curtain in there? By chance? This is J. Crew. Oh, yeah, it's got to be J. Crew. You are you. This is actually pretty cool. J. Mother Freaking Crew. It's kind of woodeny. Can I get a clear prop? <clears throat> Wear it with a pajama top. Looks like my hair. Blonde on the bottom. Brown on the roots. Well, brown mixed with gray. I don't see gray hair. There's some there. See beautiful hair. 
Say okay. kind hair. It's J. Crew. Kind? Yeah, kind hair. Kind of grows on dog days. Oh, I was like, kind? <laughs> I love you, honey. Is that another necklace now? We're going from bracelets to necklaces? Or belts, whichever. I mean, if you got a skinny waist, you can make a belt. If you have a belt like this, you need to seek medical attention. Yeah, maybe it's a leg band. Them skinny girls can put it around their thighs. Who's it belong to? I don't know where my 25 of this went. No, I don't know. What'd you do? Oh, you dropped it on the floor last time we did one of these. Here, you look. Christian Dior. I could read it. It wasn't that I could read it. I so that's read. nice. That is nice. Very nice. It just said C, C. H dot Dior. So I just put it together, you know, because I can spell. Well, it's magnetic. It's fake. I could take a picture of it. And go Maybe it's research. Christian's brother, Christopher. Christopher Dior. <laughs> Black, gold tone. Oh wow, I like it to be that one right there that's worth $7,000. Do we make it be that one? Yeah, sure. Okay. This is Spring Street, the collection, Nordstrom Rack. Those are cute. You got a Nordstrom Rack. Silver tone, little danglies. Mm hmm. Cute. Silver. Cute, cute. Yes, I know. Cute, cute. Oh. Mm. This is interesting. Pink. Is that J. Crew. <laughs> Was it Scrabble on the necklace? <laughs> it's a damn Scrabble necklace. Kate Spade. Well, I won twice. It's a damn Scrabble necklace. This is so strange. <coughs> oh, pardon me. It's like all the letters of the alphabet, but they're not in order. Mm. Maybe it's a code. It might be, can you break the code? Yeah, I can't find anything similar. Let's see if I can find Kate Spade alphabet next. But there's no way. Hmm. Interesting. Never seen anything like it. Conversation piece for sure. <laughs> Meh. Another necklace or zero rings? Zero rings. You couldn't find Kate Spade alphabet necklace? Mm -mm. It gave little pendants with a single, like a gold tab with a thingy on it. Earrings? <clears throat> yeah, it is. Silver tone. I don't see anything missing on this one. That's all right. I don't know. It's just tools. Okay. Well, those are cute. Mm hmm Is it a curtain? Yes, it's a curtain. Okay. I know Corinne's ass. She was concerned. Was that an actual curtain you found? Yeah, that's what the joke was. Because okay. she said, you say everything's a curtain. So she said, take a picture of this and tell John this is, is what a curtain, curtain looks like. Okay. That's pretty. Let me get a picture of that. <laughs> I like that. I'm going to buy that for you for your birthday. I don't want it. Thank you, though. You don't want it? <laughs> no. Um, it is. If I had my choice, I'd choose the left it's one a of size those two. Eight. Does this one say 6.99 on the right? It says 699. Oh, you would choose the $40 one? No, no, no. I would choose the left one, which when you're looking at it would be the $699. No, I'm not looking. the $40 one. This is my right when I'm looking okay, at it. Okay, you're right. Okay. 
I would actually like it to be that one right there, which is 7331. It's not 7331. The condition just came on. Damn it. I'm trying to have some job. My aunt says there's bad weather headed this way. Yeah. P A J is what it says on the inside of this. Fat ass jerk. P A J. That's you had never heard of fat spelled yes. P H? P H A T? Pretty hot and tempting. You just, and you dropped it, you broke it. Size eight. Yeah, we established that the last I don't time know what that time. it doesn't have anything missing. I don't know what that stone is. Is it a, it's not a peridot. It's a, like a I don't know. I don't know what the blue one is. It's like periwinkle or something. I, I think um John just got KS again. That's cool. Yep. It's three. These are three out of fifteen. Kendra. It's gonna be hard to hold. Oh well. Beautiful. I can see them perfectly. And this is the back. So I guess like does this comes around your ear? Hold on, let me make sure my holes aren't closed up. <laughs> That's what she said. People are like, Larissa, that's dirty. It is dirty. Oh, that's beautiful. Your ears already turn red. <laughs> it is turning red. I think that hole might have been closed. <laughs> it's not anymore. <laughs> I'll put some peroxide on these before I sell them. <laughs> and then you just dropped it and broke it. So those are pretty. Mm -hmm. I do not see anything missing. Gold tone. I love Kendra. <clears throat> yep, I don't see anything missing in either one. Cool beans. That's good. How many more? Is that J. Crew? Those are gaudy enough, I would say. R A, is that Avon? I don't know. They just say R A on them. Hmm. Really annoying. Mm-hmm. It's hard to hold them. It's very hard to hold them. Those might be some like some, some of the vintage things we found last time. What was that vintage necklace you found last time that had those brown flowers on it? Mm -hmm. Those look pretty close to it. Oh, we're missing something. I'm missing a little rhinestone on one, but you can't tell. Can't tell unless you use a loop on it. And if you're at a party and somebody's looking at your earring with a loop, they're invading your space. What if it, you're Just trying saying. To, what if you're trying to trick someone to be close to you and you're like, look at my earrings. Don't fall for it, it's a trap. Oh. I don't know who this maker is. It's a B and a B. Brooks Brothers? Not B. I don't know, I'm gonna take a picture of it. Their emblem is a pig flying. You're a pig flying. What? So it's just silver tone necklace. Let me get a picture of it. I gotta get a picture of it so that it'll be righteous. So I can find out what it is. Gold tone has an extender. Um. Here's a picture of the maker's mark. Oh, that might work. BB. Last item. Liz Claiborne? Nope. No. That's LC. But it shows her maker's mark is kind of like a BB, but it doesn't look like that one. All right. That about middle screen on the left. Hmm. 
they might oh no I'll have to look up if wild that you've ever used big booger it's pretty silver tone very pretty ring would you like one just like it it is a size too small for your fine girl seven mm-hmm mm -hmm. Hey, hey. Dang, that's a big old ring. Big old turn my finger ring. Probably. It's a little bit magnetic. <laughs> <laughs> but that dang old cubic, cubic zirconia holds it down. It's got something written in here. PD, Premier Designs. Oh, yeah, look at you go from memory. It's her free. Yeah, you're so smart. Hmm? Nice. Nice. Very pretty. Nice. Nice. All right. So, let's do a little count. One. Two for the bluish ring that I don't know what it is. Three for the Kendra earrings, the RA flower earrings, these really pretty earrings, number five. Sapphire. Six for the Nordstrom Rack. Seven for this to be determined Silver, I mean gold, gold. Eight for the alphabet suit, Kate Spade. Mm -hmm. Nine for the wooden J. Crew. Ten for Christian Dior gold magnetic, so maybe it's Christopher Dior. And. Lots of bracelets. We had lots of bracelets in our last box too. Um, which reminds me that's sitting over there and I need to get that listed. So I think it was an okay box. I don't really think it matters in my in what we've gotten if it's been from Georgia or whatever. Um, other than the packaging is better from Georgia because you get bubble bags. So we are now at that part of the video for the quad question of the day. I've done a couple of historical trivias. Now I'm going to just do a random trivia. What is the chemical process for converting sugar into alcohol? Boil. That's not a chemical process. That's a mechanical action. Evaporate. That's what happens when water turns into vapor. When a, a liquid turns into a gas, that's evaporation. Paper rocks, that's right. It's kind of, it's kind of the same though, because it's got the shun. No, that's when, that's when gas turns back into liquid. Put your answers in the uh, comments. You're going to have to please. start looking at the comments so you can answer the people. I'm sure they already know it. They're smart people out there. Except me. I have paper. I'm still so paper up scissors. <laughs> By the way, if you email me, please be patient because I just discovered that I have two junk folders on my Gmail. So I knew, I knew about one, the Thriving Thrifters, but apparently... My mail, whenever I did all my updates this last weekend, now it's got two different junk folders, and I just went into one, and I had four people who had asked me stuff about, somebody asked me about a dress from the um, haul I did with Carenza. 
So I'm not ignoring you. I do not ignore you. I, I do. I do my very best. And, yes. She and, cares about every single one of you and she'll get back to you soon, we promise. Yep. And I think I have the boxes set out um, and I have the list of things that I'm going to pack up for the winter. So I wanted to do that this weekend, but I was just pooped when I got home. Yeah, she slept like Sunday for like all morning. Well, I took a lot of pictures. No, Sunday I got up and went to work. I know, but you still slept till 10 o'clock. So anyways, I am too. going to video those boxes. They are going to go out in five pound priority because it's just, just easier for me to get the label that way. So I'm going to video um, putting those boxes together for the people who won the, in the March Madness. Yay. I'm going to try and do that this week. Cool beans. And I hope that you will give this video a like. I hope that you will subscribe to the channel. If the button below my head is red, smash it and turn it gray, please. And we'll see you in the next one. Peace.